And what do we have here? It's a package. It's for something called the Drive Hub. I saw this online when I was googling if my PS4 racing wheel would work with the Xbox Series X. And this came up, so I thought I'd have a quick look at this. Now it's not cheap, it's about £100. But if you've already got a wheel that was like £150, £200, £300 and you want to get on the Xbox and you don't want to pay another 300 quid for a wheel you use this from LPG uh, that's where I ordered it from and you connect your wheel into this with your Xbox control pad into the actual drive hub itself and it should theoretically allow you to play with your racing wheel that was made for the PlayStation on the Xbox or vice versa so you could actually also play you know the other one so this is the drive hub box very simple very plain I'm not a big fan of the red and the black because being colorblind you can't really tell the difference and it's like very plain and boring but we'll get into it I'm not sure what really there will be for this box because it looks quite small so into this now so again nothing really there is there there is a thank you for purchasing the drive hub the online manual can be found online <laughs> thanks for that and then I guess that's French but here is a braided USB is it a mini or no micro to USB A and another USB um, A to a micro and again they're nicely braided cables so they look quite nice um, the actual drive hub itself but I'll get back to that so this is just some velcro so I'd have a guess what they were wanting you to maybe do is velcro this to the wheel so you don't lose the little drive hub or maybe velcro it to the side of the wall so it's like always there but you can see there's where you put the actual console in, the the control pad, the wheel and there's some little LEDs to show you what's happening very simple, very nothing, nothing else in the box it's a very cheap plasticky feel for that so that is the drive hub itself so we'll have a quick go in a second to see how this sort of works but you can see there that's where all your ports are at the back of it so anyway <clears throat> I'm just on the floor with my Xbox Series X um, plug the control pad into the controller bit of it I think that's so it can get the signal that you're using and then you get actually no that was the the insert in the console onto it and now that's the controller so that you can get the signal and then finally the actual racing wheel and that just goes into the little box as well so that's that so looking around at this it's nothing is working but I found out what was wrong I had it set to PS3 not um, PS4 not PS3 so turning it onto the PS3 mode it connects flawlessly and that my friends mint